price of cotton is now the highest it's been in more than two years, and farmers on the South Plains say they're feeling cautiously optimistic. KLBK's Alyssa Tejas spoke to the folks over at Plains Cotton Growers and shows us what this means for our farmers. <laughs> It was a it was a tough year. 2020. Really, all year long, struggled with very little moisture. Um, we had enough at planting time to bring our crop up, but then it stopped. A bad year in more ways than one, even for our farmers. We didn't harvest most of our dry land out here. What we did was very low yields. Now, farmer Stephen Brosh is feeling cautiously optimistic. The price of cotton is now 81 cents per pound the highest it's been in more than two years. The crop year that we've had as of late uh, was, was uh, significantly reduced the last couple of months compared to what USDA estimates and the trade estimate was looking at going into the first part of the growing season. Because of weather-related conditions, the supply of cotton was low, creating an influx in the price and an increase in demand for cotton. It gives producers an opportunity to look at a good crop mix of what may be beneficial to their operation uh, as a whole. But for now, Brosh says he plans to play it safe. It can go down just as quickly as it's gone up, especially we've learned that from this last year. Brosh doesn't plan to change his input or make new purchases. But after a difficult few years, Brosh is hopeful for 2021. And following the snow, he says it's already off to a better start. We'll just have to see what happens from here on out. But right now, yeah, we're all right. Alyssa Tejas, Kale Bikay News.